Right now, he's in a maximum security prison for security reasons. So today we've taken a closer look at the testimony about his time behind bars. John Duran shares what the prison warden has to say. Richard Allen has been at the Westfield Correctional Facility, a maximum security state prison since this past fall. Westville's warden John Gallipo testifying in court Thursday. Allen's cell is eight and a half feet by 12 feet outlined here and all that's inside is a fixed bed frame with a mattress on top, a toilet and a Bible. Also a security camera recording him 24 hours a day. We found out Allen's cell is actually smaller than a parking space. Gallipo testified Allen is the only pretrial inmate housed in the prison's maximum security unit. In his cell, like every inmate, Allen is given an electronic tablet that allows him to listen to music, watch movies, and make phone calls. But a prison investigator is able to monitor those calls. He's also allowed one hour of recreation time five times a week and is allowed to shower three times a week. Unlike other inmates, Allen is allowed face-to-face -face visits with his family. Gallipo and the Carroll County prosecutors say Allen is receiving the same treatment as other inmates and in some cases is being treated better. Allen's defense says his physical and mental health have deteriorated dramatically because of his incarceration at Westville. Criminal defense attorney Stacy Uliana agrees. He hasn't been convicted of anything. He hasn't committed any misconduct in jail, but yet he's being held in a small cell where he's having no contact with anyone, and that's deteriorating his mental health. That is very unusual and very extraordinary. Gallipo testified when Allen is being transported from his cell to other locations within the prison, he's placed in chains with cuffs around his hands, feet, and torso, and is sometimes transported with a restraint chain, which his defense team described as a leash similar to those used to walk a dog. At 6, I'll tell you why prison security have been monitoring Allen all hours of the day. In Indianapolis, John Duran, 13 News. Now, the judge did agree to sign a restraining order preventing Westville Correctional Facility staffers from recording future meetings between Allen and his attorneys. You can catch up on everything else that happened in court on our website. Just scan this QR code right here on your screen. It'll then take you to WTHR.com Delphi.